You have to like give me your Discord information. I need to whisper you my account. Uh, just type it in the chat. In the chat, I can't view whispers. And then I'll add you, and then I'll invite you to the call, and then we can get the real professional cartoon kid to race against. Hey, what's up, Baku? Five, you want to join us? Um, I'd love to, but I'm trying. I'm really, I really just want to try to PB grind. So, All right. I just did one yesterday, and kind of. Felt like I missed an hour of good gameplay I was doing. Gotcha. Even the start of this game is like... Mm. Mm -hmm. Like, with the little logo, it just melts away. You just know exactly... Man, I'm in for some shit. Alright, there's the VC win. Yo, what's up? Hey. Um, Yo, how's it going? Good day. Yep, I'm having a great day. I'm hot for once. <laughs> I've never, I'm, I'm I've never played this before, Baku. CFG would, CFG would probably literally want to be woken up for that, something like this. <laughs> I don't have his phone number, though. I mean, I could... I could. I'll message Waff. I'll see if Waffle's up. Waffle. Where's the American flag? This is a PAL only game. Yeah, but where's the American flag? I speak American, not. Stop. <laughs> I don't speak any of these languages. Oh, I see what you're talking about. At the beginning of the game, we have to pick a language. Yeah. Yeah. So, may I ask something, Coach Kid? What drew you into this game? If you don't Why? Mind the Rickster. The Rickster. The Rixer as well? Yeah, yeah. he was doing streams of uh, of uh, Slide 2 Episode 6, and then on Halloween he played this game instead, and I was like, this looks like a fun meme game, I'll play this. Yeah, yeah. that's exactly what happened on CFG. That's on yeah, the that's CFG. Now I need to change my PS2. To if you look at my, uh, my uh, SRC account, you can see a different game that I played, and I have uh, the exact same reason. A streamer played it, and then I like copied it. Yeah. Right, right. No, I think that's valid. I mean, the only reason I started playing this was because CFG was, you know, showing it so much, and I was like, okay, what the <laughs> fuck is this, you know? CFG, this is the seventh time this week you've shown Monster Racer for the PS1. <laughs> yes, <laughs> exactly. It's, it's, like, it's like, damn, bro, you really want me to play it that bad? It's like, fuck. And then I played it. Well, it's fun, too, because, like, not only is it, like, a fun, like, meme game, but, like, it's bad, but it's, it's good. Like, it's fun to shit on. Yeah. Cause, cause, like straight up, like if it's a truly like unplayable game, like no one would have fun with it. But yeah, I mean, like you I mean, want this... it to be in the F tier where it's it's bad, it's terrible, but it's at least a little bit enjoyable. You wouldn't want it to be so bad that it's you know boring and you, it has no redeeming qualities whatsoever. Yeah, for sure, for sure. Agree. It's the difference between getting a 10 on a test and a 0. <laughs> I, I guess, yeah, yeah. Oh, gosh. I'm, I'm ready, dude. I got my Monster Racer splits open. I gotta make sure. Uh, Kami, do you have splits? Or are you just gonna time it like... I don't. I'm to finish? fucking monkey. Do you think dude, I'm... Just, just time it from uh, start to finish. Yeah, I'm fucking monkey. That's what I meant. I'm not doing all that fancy shit. What was the spreadsheet for this game? Cause there was a spreadsheet. There was. There a spreadsheet. Oh yeah, one of the mods made a spreadsheet for the best characters. I think Daigo's the best. Okay, I just kind of hovered over Daigo. I'm assuming Daigo's the best if you know how to like play the game. Yeah. It's X to to drive, uh, R1 to boost, Square to break, and the, the you can use the analog stick or the the D pad. It's basic kart racer. Okay, so. X to go forward, yeah. square to go, briggy, R1 to go boosty, sticky yeah. to go turny. Yep, and circle to use items if need yeah. be. I think that's all of the item, all of the, the buttons that you need to know. There's also, you can turn around, which is not that useful, and there's a wide and narrow camera view, which is useless. Like, it's not good whatsoever. So, like... 
Um, uh, what what's the difference between a boost and an item? You want the boost. The you item the is like shit you drop on the ground that like the AIs will most of the time avoid, and the boost is something that's gonna like make you go insanely fast. The boost in this yeah. game are no joke. You want like, the orange, the orange pot. You want the basically. orange er, pot or the blue pot? Or the green, I guess it is. Rip. But the orange is the absolute peak. So, like, there's there's items and then there's urns on tracks? Or is it just you hit a box and it's, then you got a hole? It's uh, part of the item pool. Oh, okay. So, uh, Slash, Slash, get in here. We're racing Monster Racer with Cartoon Kid. Get your ass in here. I see you in my chat. I like how I'm we'll not important enough to be two. included in that oh, statement. Oh no! Oh no! No! Uh, slash. We'll do Crash Two after Monster Racer, and I'll see if my PS2 can handle it. It crashed the first time. That, that's why. I, that's why I'm on Monster Racer. Crash Bandicoot Two. Crash Bandicoot Two legit crashed. Who would have guessed? Yeah. I gotta eat and do some house stuff. Uh, uh you good? I'm very tired, so give me like three mental seconds to like process that I'm really doing this with my life. No, 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 take it in, take it in, breathe it in, breathe it out. <laughs> Don't worry, know? I've done this like ten times with my life, so we're good. Yeah, I've done yeah. this. I've done this eight, so legit would love to play with Cartoon Kid though, maybe <laughs> next time. Yeah. Don't worry, I kidnapped him. He'll, he'll be here for like the next five yeah, races. Yeah, I'm not leaving, I can't. Yeah. What do you? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> I kidnapped him. He ain't leaving. <laughs> All right. Um. Wait. When All does right. time start? Uh, when you select the character, or as soon as you pick a character, as soon as you yeah. pick a character, yeah. And then, um, last question. We're all racing on easy. Yeah. You can do whatever difficulty you want, but easy is the best. I wonder why. That was ironic, but that was not ironic. That was sarcasm, by the way. Right, ready when you guys are. Who's gonna count down? I'm ready when I'm good. I'm good. You, Cartoon? Uh, hang on. Give me a, like a moment. Yeah, you good? My goal isn't even to beat Cartoon Kid in this race. My goal is to beat fucking CFG, dude. He's like I mean, one minute ahead of me. You're using Duckstation, so you have like a, or rather, I, I have the handicap already. I'm using Duckstation as well. No, you're using Duck. I'm using EPSXC. EPSXC has so my better lens. Yeah, it has loads, better yeah. loads, yeah. Yeah, I see what you're saying. You just gotta make sure that my uh, my USB doesn't switch my uh, audio connection, because it sometimes does that. Is yeah. there a specific duck station where it's about to be We're gonna do this yeah. into the microphone. Um, it doesn't matter. <laughs> I don't think it matters. Why is Dragula, Hitchpock? Oh, these names. <laughs> you think you pick who you want? I think the meta everyone has gone with is Digo. Oh no, I'm looking at the names and I'm like, God, damn it, dude! Clack is so fucking based though. Look at this fucking skeleton boy. Look yeah, at this guy. that one's that one's the only name that I appreciate, and I would have even accepted Fidula for Clack, but oh, he's so cool too! Look, he's a skeleton with a top hat. Everyone else looks dumb. I, I like the mummy, who's one of the upside down pyramid. I like the wolf. I feel like if oh, furries yeah. were into this game, they would like the wolf as well. The wolf Fucking looks furries. is like a surfer dude. Yeah. <laughs> Look at Wolf go. Why she has? Why does Victoria have the boob window like that? That just looks like an ass, like an ass Logic. crack. That's dude, fine. dude, I lost. All right, that's enough of that. Hey, what the fuck, Kami? What? What did I do? Did I say something like? Am I gonna get canceled? All right, uh, Coachun, you ready? Yeah. Yeah, you got everything set. Uh, I think, uh, I think, Kami, you ready? Sadly. All right, I think we're all ready, so uh, let's get a countdown from uh, someone, and let's get this shit going, dude. I'm excited. All right. Wait, wait, actually... Do it besides me? Wait, 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 I wait, can wait. do it, I guess, if you want. I'm here. Oh, you got back take five? I, I thought you uh, left. No, I'm just been... Oh, I left because, yeah, it was getting all robot -y. I had to restart Discord. It was good enough. Oh, okay. Yeah, so on go. Oh, when does the final time, by the way? 
Um, when you cross the finish line on Volcano Reverse. So you do Volcano twice. It's just all the ILs added up anyway, so... Yeah, so okay. it's not a big so deal if you see... time late. No, yeah. yeah. Okay, hey. Sangha. Yep. Three, two, one, go. Good luck, good luck. <laughs> yeah, I was yawning into the mic, I'm sorry. I can promise you this game will not crash for me, because it's is there... not on my busted PS2. Is there, like, boost before you hit the start? Button? Yes, you get no, a full no, tank. No, yeah. no, you don't get boost like uh, like in CTR where you can like power up before you start. Oh, okay. You just go. Oh, you just I, oh, but you do bad. start with a boost that you okay. can use immediately. Yeah, you start with a canister of boost, but yeah, I, I misheard yeah. the question. Uh, yeah, no, yeah. this isn't like none of the like, you know, you push like a cell rate before a green. Like, yeah. No. There's no that would be a good mechanic. Mind. Yeah. That, would that was a 38 <laughs> second loading screen. Get yeah, used to it. Yeah, welcome, welcome. Oh yeah, we're all playing on Duck Station, so this is like as fair as it gets. Well, not me. Oh, yeah, you EP my bad. I keep forgetting your EPX. <laughs> you want to run into the little... Oh, I got smalled five seconds into this track. I don't I think see you're going to take my record boost. for getting eight smalls on Botanic Garden Reverse. I don't think so. I got reversed. Fuck. Oh, okay, so the boost is in the lower right. I thought it was, but it yeah. didn't look like it was going down. And then once you run out of boost, you just want to keep dropping items and getting item boxes. Oh, big urn! Let's go! Yeah, once you get the urn, like, it lasts forever, pretty much. The big urn or the any urn? Small yeah. one. It, the big one lasts forever, it feels. Yeah. Oh, I love Big Run. This game is so fun, dude, when you have Big Run. It's like getting uh, addiction withdrawals. No, yeah, exactly. When you lose Big Run, man, does it not feel good. But when you first get it, fuck yeah. yeah. I, just, I just snorted a shit ton of cocaine. <laughs> I just got smalled. It makes me feel small. I just got smalled again. Get Damn, dude. It's only been like one minute I've been smalled twice. Oh yeah, Cartoon Kid, one thing you'll realize about us is we are complainers. If, if mm. I get more people in here, only thing you'll hear is people bitching about their luck. No oh, one yeah. ever has good fucking luck in this game when all of us play. Oh Everyone... no, I do that. Like, in all of the runs that I've failed where I got in bad time, I've complained. So, the only good thing to do is shut up and then you don't get, like, bad luck. Y oh yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh my God. Hey, this is gonna be a bigger... Wait, one <laughs> when you break in this game, you just stop. Yeah, you stop. The crab bucket of Monster Racer. I will say that this might be a community worst. I believe I lapped. Evil Derek be like, yo, this is a community worst. <laughs> yeah, because the other day he was like, this is a community death. <laughs> but wouldn't it be Evil Derek be like, this is a community goal? I got reversed and I see, I see that up. so often, you don't even yeah, know. Yeah, but it never happens. The reverse lasts! Oh, oh. <laughs> cartoon. I got chain chopped. <laughs> I didn't mean it like that. It's small. I'm crying, bro. <laughs> can, I just, can I just post that to a community worst? That was me, sorry. <laughs> Dude, holy fuck, I'm already losing time. Like, I'm like I'm already losing time compared to my splits, and I'm like still on like, my fucking... Like, Fourth lap, it feels like. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm 20 seconds behind, so this is pretty good. I, Just I'm an average faster race. I was like two minutes behind, or like one and a half minutes behind by museum. Damn. My Did you bring record. it back to PB? Yeah, I got a world record after that. I even said in the oh. video if I don't get like uh, like sub plus 30 by the end of Volcano, I would just reset. Everyone. And I, did. I got that, so. Slash has a point. Everyone for hours. Hell yeah, let's play Monster Racer. Everyone, one second in. Holy shit, get me out of here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but it's like addicting though. Like, All right, you can't first lap. You in. I got first. I got first. It's like thinking about Monster Racer, pleasant thoughts. Actually playing Monster Racer, oh, get me the fuck out of here. Fuck Laku this, dude, small again, you little bitch. <laughs> Baku said, uh, this looks like ass. This makes me sad. Let's race it. All right, Baku. <laughs> Let's All let's right. race this sometime. Did anybody else like finish the first race? Kicking around something right in the middle of exactly. Please oh, don't yeah, tell me I'm the first one that finished. 
No, I finished. Okay. I'm on port. Finish what? Botanic Garden or Port? Uh, Botanic Garden. I uh, know we already did that, all of us. Okay, good. <laughs> oh my gosh. D dude, I... I... I gotta hold my tongue, dude. <laughs> I think I'm learning strat. I think this game is unironically a funner meme game than CTO. I mean, uh, uh, than uh, Crash Bash, I meant to say. Yeah, because Crash Bash lasts not even going to Because Crash Bash lasts like four hours, and like people always tell me, like, oh, we should race it sometime. It'd be a fun meme race. And like after doing one run of that, it's like, oh my god, that's that's a little long for a fucking meme race. I don't know. This so many more when it lasts that long, and you have to make such a commitment. No, it sucks. I cry. <laughs> when you're small and you boost, do you just not gain speed? Because I think I wasted yeah, a shit ton of. Yeah, you don't yeah, get. Don't yeah, don't boost. use boost once you. If if you're in a bear trap or in a tornado or get small or anything like that, don't use boost because you don't gain any speed from it. Okay, because I, I wasted a shit ton. Oh, okay. I got okay. flashed. You know, it's a good game when they don't nice. disable your ability to boost when you have those. Yeah. Slash just finished. I think he's I think he's talking about my 2D avatar. I think he has just finished, ladies and gentlemen. I wanna race Lego Star Wars New Game Plus OE. That's that's kind of hype. I don't I, I don't mess with any of the Lego games though. I found them boring as a child. I don't know oh, really? why. I'm yeah, I don't know why. Forward. There's a there's a collection coming out, I think, next year with all nine like uh, Lego Star Wars games. You gotta play oh, that. Really? I'd give it a shot, why not? I'm kind of shocked that they haven't time. already released a collection of that. Yeah, welcome to Well, this is new, uh, new animations, new voices, and all that. This is how you know I'm mind broken. I'm upset at my time already, and it makes me want to play the game again. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we we got her hooked. Let's go. I don't know, Monster Race. I like. I think it's already funny that it's at like a, a ten active runners on SOC. But like, I think it'd be really funny if we somehow got to like 20 or 25, because then it would be like almost on the front page. People would be like, that's, what the fuck is that's that? that's the pipe dream. Yeah. Seeing Monster Race on the front page, that'd be some shit. I had a lot of- I did a drunk stream of this uh, one time, I, and I actually got a world record with the drunk stream, and that was really fun, so... It's not like again. your Star Wars The Complete Saga, what's the fucking point? Yeah, that is true. Oh, so I cannot believe I read that acronym, Slash. I deserve some bonus credit for that. I didn't even register what that was supposed to mean. Like, me. You, what, when you read the comment? Yeah, same. Yeah. I, I can't believe I somehow knew that. Oh, big urn! That's so hype. What's the Sadly difference between breaking and no, no longer holding accelerate? It's almost uh, the same thing. I I think breaking's like a little faster. Yeah. Like, like, like... But like, yeah, it's not much of anything. I think it's totally up to you which one you do. Wow, that was... Wow, I saved 14 seconds on port at least. No bonus credit, only boner credit. Hey, I got bigger. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Oh my gosh. Wait, what does the bat do? Because I'm scared. I've never seen it before. It's like a red Cooper shell. Is oh. it? Yeah. Huh. Cool, I used it on oh, somebody I lapped. Yeah, you can do that. Mad jungle I lapped time, baby. the third place. Yeah, lapping people is easy in this game. <laughs> I know, but Jesus. Well, I imagine when you're playing on easy mode. When you play on yeah. easy, yeah. I I've heard when you play on hard, it's literally like the most unfair bullshit. Yeah, it is actually. I did it to to unlock the master, which I don't need because the password is on on the board. But yeah, like it's it's not easy. Wait, at all. It's, what? It's really hard. Also, hey, I finished my second. Let's go. I'm yeah, assuming everyone's on mad jungle. It's not even hard in like a fair way. No, it's unfair. It's like uh, you know, in, like the Legendary. Lion King. The, the original Lion King game, where they artificially made it harder, just so you can put in more quarters. It's like that. No, it was made... It, you're talking about, like, the Genesis game, right? 
Is it? Is it? Yeah, it's the Genesis game because they made it specifically like that because Disney was like, "Yay, oh fuck rental stores!" Because you know, they wouldn't. When you're renting a game, it's not you're you're not buying a whole game. They want you to buy a whole game because then they get more money. So they made it harder so that people would you know buy the game. Isn't that what I said, or am I mistaken? You said uh quarters. Oh, it's, it's not an arcade. arcade. Yeah, well, it's the same. Yeah. Same logic, really. Same yeah. logic, yeah. <laughs> Holy shit. My Digo has never been so red. I've never seen Dingo so fucking red in my life, dude. What is... I I don't get the logic of somebody actually buying a game that they find too hard. Like, why would they just not... not... Because the logic is we don't want them to beat it and we want them to, like, you know, get angry and then, like, complete it. And like you know, on all that, I really because once they I finish think most the game, kids would they, just they never have no finish reason the to game. play it anymore. Yeah, because once they finish, but I don't know. I think it's if you strike a good balance, some kids would be suckered into like keep renting it because they want to see what the game has afterwards. Like Ninja it's Gaiden. Probably, it's probably, it's probably, yeah, it's probably a balance though. Like if you make it too hard, kids will, will like, be like, oh, I don't give a shit. This game sucks. It's too tough. But if you make it just right, kids will be like, shit, I gotta rent that game again. You know. <laughs> I got red urn. Was this, I w I didn't use my boost the whole first lap, and then I got red urn. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> how does fuck? Gotcha. How red can I get before I stop boosting? I think if you get too red, you'll blow up and like spin yeah, out. Do. But you, you don't like do super oh, okay. You just stop as if you hit like uh, an item, like the the mine or the bat. But if you continuously boost with the, uh, oh my with the big urn, I think you should be fine, even if you use up the entirety of it. It's Unless once you get, you get multiple urns in a row, that's when yeah. you should be careful. Generally. I don't like that oh this game gosh, starts you off. Oh my gosh, I the community gold! 311, bo 311 fucking mad jungle forward, baby. I bet you that's a community gold. I'm so behind everybody, Jesus. Let's fucking go! Who had it, or has it? Is it Waffle? I don't know, but I got a 311 on Mad Jungle Forward, and I bet money he did not get a 311. I think his time was like 314, 315. Wait, what? 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 What record? Uh, Mad Jungle Forward. Shit. That's gotta be a community goal. There's no fucking way it's not. I really should have had the spreadsheet open. I make this blunder every fucking time I play this I'm game. Look, I'll look it up for you. Yeah. Fuck. Thank you, take five. <laughs> yeah. I don't like that this is game is like, hey, you start at zit lap zero, so once you hit, like, five, you're done. Yeah. <laughs> it bothers me so much. Maybe the French are, like, different when it comes to racing. The French yeah, are I don't wrong. understand that. Yeah, like fucking you start at zero, then once you hit five, you're done. No, it like, makes what? complete sense, but we're not but that's used not to what it. Anyone does. Yeah. What, yeah. It makes sense, but it's not what people do. It depends on what perspective. Like, it, you could read the counter as in what lap are you on or how many laps you've completed. Both are correct. It's just that one is like heavily more used than the other. Yeah, because you're usually on like lap Frustrated. one, <laughs> rather than forest. Yeah. Mad Jungle, you said. Yeah, Mad Jungle Four. Yeah, What's the time? Twelve ninety. Oh, I beat it! I just took Waffles Community Gold. Because <laughs> I had a three eleven. Let's go. Yeah. Let's go. I got Red Urn at the end of the race. Yep. That, yep. Happen. that happens all the f time, dude. I'm telling you. Oh, I got each better day. if you didn't get it at all, because at least the the game doesn't take pity on you. <laughs> Fresh, I, hey, I I golded frustrating forest, so let's go. So easy. Now do a couple more, and then the record is yours. 
Yeah, I wish... just, yeah, just 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 community gold. Of... Dude, that community gold was insane. I got two big urns and I got like four small urns. I, I was surprised Waffle was even that close. He must have had an, had insane RNG as well. I feel like he's gonna go well. into the time from mode, the, like the arcade mode, and just grind it. Be like, no, it's mine. I want the, my jungle. Yeah. Oh, what a tornado placement! What a fucking witch! I'm so happy I avoided that, dude. Oh, <coughs> Suck D deleted his speedrun.com profile. Wait, he deleted it? Yeah, like I don't that. know what what happened to him. Wait, why? I don't know. Who knows? But that's Jeez. what happened. Rest in peace, homie. I'll be sure to pour one out for this random stranger I know nothing about. The other mod for the game, or they they were. He came up with the the stats and the. I think he made the spreadsheet originally for the. The times. Oh, I actually really it feels bad. Yeah. Like, he sounds so like vital. Auto splitter. <laughs> Is the auto splitter still up? No. Shit. I didn't download it, so I can't publicize it. Damn it! I hope someone did. Did because. Wait, he made an auto splitter for for, for Monster Racer or for yeah. Bizhawk? In Bizhawk. What's an auto splitter? And it will automatically uh, split for you based on what pops up on screen. Or like reading RAM. Reading that is RAM, yeah. fucking yeah, that's, uh, insane. Like Jesus. Yeah, yeah. People are geniuses. We I live in 2021. Yeah. Feature is now. What's next? Fucking small confection ovens that allow you to fry your food using only air? <laughs> Maybe. You never know. <laughs> that would be something. Put a patent on that quick. The good news though is I have 40 seconds of time saved and um, I think it's Museum Reverse. My Museum Reverse hat was in so bad I lost 40 seconds to it. So if I stay on pace with these splits I should be good. Someone lied to me and told me they're farther behind than I think everybody is. It'll help me feel better. <laughs> Derek, how, do, how much do you need to PB to get my uh, record? To get your record? Like, ward record? Yeah. yeah. Oh, jeez. I think, like, two minutes. Oh, jeez. Yeah. I I'm a minute behind CFG, and CFG is, is like, a, a minute behind, like, you and Waffle. So I would need a PB by almost two minutes, so... You have to get some insane community golds right now. Well, yeah. I got one. My issue... Is is Louis not even like like the trap? Like my issue is Louis just the bad power ups. I think the reverse controls affects me so much more than most people. Most people shrug it off. I get fucked by that shit. Like I get really Louis screwed by it too. That's been poured over ice. Hey, maybe. I am behind you, Kami. All right, thank you, Baku. Kami slash is actually participating right now. He's on Botanic Odin. You have this. <laughs> Is Slash actually participating? And I'm pretty sure, like, no, no, they're late. No. Okay, I was about to say, like, the timer is probably much later than mine. But the God Gamer could probably catch up to us any moment if he just started now. If he just started now, yeah. I'm cold. I have two slices of pizza here to comfort me after Monster Racer. Oh, yeah. PB Pizza. <laughs> PB pizza, yeah. PB, technical PB. I'm on Volcano, what the fuck? Wait, Slash is on Volcano. Damn, Slash. Like, actually dead ass? Yeah, probably not, but he said it in my chat, so I mean, it must be true, because chatters yeah. don't lie. Oh, why would Slash ever lie? <laughs> Even if it was yeah. for a joke, like... That is serious business. Well, just in general, like, people in my chat never lie, so... I, I got literally them. every community gold. You got every community go fuck slash ah. shit. What are we gonna do? Dude, we're just happy you're holding it back, dude. Don't release the document. Don't release the footage, okay, until a little bit. Imagine less. if you just found a bunch of way to like skip laps by going out of bounds. Oh fuck. Hey, I just went out of bounds. Yeah, you know how you can like fall through the map sometimes? What if you could like go backwards and fall through the map and trigger like the next lap? I thought about that on port and I tried and it didn't work. Interesting. Uh, I'm glad you tried that. Oh, so if you have an item, you can't get another item. Nope. 
if you hold an active item that you can use, like the uh, volcano, not volcano, uh, tornado, sorry, or the mine, then if you don't use it, then yeah, you won't get another one. But if you, if it's like, uh, like the urn, that is an insta-use item, kind of, then yeah. uh, you can pick up another one. Oh, Will it replace the urn? Seconds. Yeah, I would never, ever lie. I'm never sarcastic. Slash, you're the most honest person I've ever met in my life. What do you, what, does it replace the urn? Uh, no. Okay. If you get a potion, the small urn, then it does replace it. Okay. So it's pretty much based on, like, luck just to always get item boxes if you can. Oh, yeah. yeah. This whole run... Unless you like, have a big urn, then avoid. If, yeah, if you, if you have can. a big urn, then don't fucking touch the item boxes. Yeah. <laughs> that's legit the you meta. Might, you might get another big urn, that's pretty good, or you might get a potion, which will override your big urn, which is not good. But, like, statistically, you're not I likely... they're equal. But, it, yeah, it's unlikely to get, like, either or, but I wouldn't risk it. Because the... the Listen, uh, if you're gonna push this game to the full extent, you have to risk everything. I mean, I might as well run cheat percent, then. Uh, that's why we have cheat percent, yeah. Yeah. Kinda wanna run that. Oh, big urn! Also, we'll you figure can't it talk out. about this game without talking about its dope ass music. That loops after like 10 seconds. Yes. <laughs> and is, isn't it like just reused and very slightly altered in several tracks? <laughs> Pretty much. Pretty much. <laughs> Some of them, yeah. My favorite thing is that this main thing, main theme I'm listening to right now is used at the beginning of Botana Goden, this track. I believe even another track, even it's the end credits song. It's like when all the names are going by, this is the song it plays during the credits. I'm very proud of this song. So I... you get to hear this song like five fucking times. This is the main theme. <laughs> this is the main Monster Racer theme. If I worked <laughs> on that game, I wouldn't want to be listed in the credits. I'm <laughs> legitimately tired because I had a really big day and this game is making me even more tired. My eyes kind of hurt. <laughs> you guys, I, I mean, I'm getting really excited for this game. That was many people talking at once. Yes, it was. Yeah. <laughs> Duck station, okay, Baku. Bro. If this game's making you tired, then you should have a pretty uh, good night's sleep tonight. I might pass the fuck out now, because, like, I'm tired. Like, I went to the, um... When I eventually got myself out of the bed, I uh, went to the hospital and ran around that a bunch of times. Um, and some people there offered me different positions, starting at, um... Uh, Essentially, it's starting at 15, so what's going to happen is that right now it's... Or, sorry, starting at 18. Uh, essentially, right now, they're starting at 15, but on December 5th, everybody's pay is going up to 18 at minimum. So, by the time I get the job, it'll be 18. Um, ran, ran to the library to print some resumes and cover letters. Or, my resume and my cover letters. Uh, stopped by a U.S. cellular. Stopped by Walmart. And, by the way, the library's, like pretty decently far away from me for me and I did it on foot um back and forth uh US cellular a Panera bread uh they offered me 13 starting and I'm like mm, no um and then I went to a Panda Express because they're offering 15 starting um the thing about the hospital is that it's going to take a while to like actually have applications go through so Depending on how long a while is, I might as well just get the panda job. Um, and then, once my if the applications go through, I can be like, alright, see you guys. Um, yeah. Then I went to a T-Mobile to see how much they were starting for, and then I went to a Little Kaiser's to pick up food. And then I walked all the way back home. Easy peach, what a fucking day and a half, Kami. Like, I think I have over, um, <laughs> 10 yeah. miles logged. That was such a shitty Not museum. Even on these splits, I was supposed to save a shit ton of time. I didn't say fucking diddly dick. Oh, man. I'm not looking good for PB potential. What made you think I was uh -oh. doing security, Baku? Also, I like libraries. Libraries are cool. You know what's cooler than a library, though? What? 
Monster Racer. Hmm? On the DS. Oh, the so when I went to the library, I sat down there for like a little bit just to take a break and to drink a drink and all that stuff. And then like the security guard kind of like came out, and I was just kind of like having a friendly conversation. And then when I went to the door, they were like, "Yeah, you can't go in there." And like, huh? essentially, like they didn't say it like that, but then we like had a back and forth, and then I just didn't understand why I couldn't. Like he was like bringing up school and stuff like that. I'm like, oh well, you know, I dropped out because you know financial reasons they're like what do you mean you dropped out of high school i'm like no i dropped out of college and he's like how old are you and i'm like i'm this age she's like holy shit do you have an id <laughs> i had to show him my id so i could go to the library because he thought i was a high schooler trying to skip class wow. why would he care because you're not supposed to let high schooler eat they had they're liable if a high schooler skips how are they? What? 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 It's I've weird. Never heard of yeah, that's so weird. Gosh. I mean, escaping class at a library, Baku, it could be like, you know, they get, they just go onto the computer and do whatever they want. Though, personally, when I skip class, I skip class at the college nearby because I was so much, much more interested in what they were teaching at the college than at my school. Um, what about that? Yeah, like, you would skip there just so you could go and use the internet. Um... Larg. Oh my gosh, this run has been dreadful. What classes did you sit in at the college? Um, I sat into, like, this one English class, but, like... I, I don't remember the exact name of it, but it was, like, an analyzing different books and stories and pieces and I thought it was like actually intro interesting introspective rather than like this is a high school class so we're gonna tell you what it means rather than everyone discussing critically what they believe it means and their different perspectives on it yeah hmm. like I am completely disinterested I interested in people's perspective on it but i don't like it when it's like this is exactly what it means and you need to think this way because fuck authoritarianism question authority i mean is it authoritarianism if that's what the author like made deliberately clear no i'm saying i'm saying i don't like when teachers try to propagate something as one thing rather than allowing for different perspectives and understandings of like the piece of work. I mean if the piece of work is literally like this guy ran up and started doing a Nazi salute and started killing Jews then it's pretty obvious hey this book is about a Nazi fucking doing terrible things. But if it's more like um Kin uh, Kinkad? I think that's how you pronounce it. Kinkad work. D depending if you're a young person, you'll view uh, Kinkad one way in which, like, a parent is being cruel to their daughter versus an older person who might find it humorous um, when they say, why would you be the type of person that the baker would not allow to touch bread? Like, this is how you do this as a woman. This is how you do this as a woman. This is how you, like, sew a shirt. This is how you do this. To a younger person, it would be like, oh, you're just kind of conforming her into, like, you know, a specific gender role and being, like, bossy and this and this and that. Whereas an older person might view it and be like, oh, it's, you know, a, an older person trying to pass on, like, generational intelligence to somebody that is just not understanding like, this is how, this is what you do in society. I'm sorry, I'm not really explaining it well, because I'm in Mines and I'm trying to, like, I'm actually having fun in Mines. Yeah, having fun in Monster Race, so that's what we like to hear. Like, in Mines, not the rest. Like, this, I have to stop and readjust. Like, this feels engaged versus other ones where I'm just tired. If you it like also, mines, something tells me you'll be a huge fan of Iceberg. Is Iceberg just mines but different power? No, it's 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 if you took mines, opened it up, and then you had no clue where the fuck you was going. 
I have no clue where the fuck I'm going in mine. Oh, well, then you're gonna fucking love Iceberg. It'll be worse. It's gonna be so much worse when you get the fucking Iceberg. I mean, I... Iceberg is the definition of what the fuck, this is where the track goes. I don't mind that because at least that's like something that's different and new. Yeah. Like, I think I'm taking Woo! a shortcut at the start. 217 Iceberg, I think I just got another community goal. Find a monster racer, don't accept this run at CFG. No, no, Slash, don't tell CF. Yo, 217 Iceberg? I, kn I know that's a community goal just looking at my splits. I is, Icecore, is Iceberg after mine? Uh, yeah, it's after mine. I'm a whole ass race behind you. <laughs> I am now entering Teeth Pass. I'm entering Iceberg. Teeth Pass is a like six fucking minute track though. If my time is not last place, I'll submit it. But if it's last place, I'm not gonna submit it. Oh, you should you you should submit it anyway. Come on, you won't no. be, take five's last place, I mean, and he he holds it with pride. I don't think he is actually. I'm pretty he, sure. Who's last place? I thought it was it Tex. Cyber Demon. No, no, it ain't Tex anymore. Is it? I thought it was Slash. Is it Slash? <laughs> Nobody <laughs> can agree. <laughs> no one fucking knows. I it used to be <laughs> Cyber <laughs> Demon, and then Take Five and Slash. Yeah, I think it. No, no you know what? I'm gonna be last. I'm yeah. gonna be last, dude. Just delete your run and just upload a new one. That's like way yeah, that's genius. Or like make a new account. Yeah, I do no mic. I just thought no about if, you, if you make if you make a bunch of new accounts, you can just increase the active players for Monster Racer. Think Has about that. that. Yeah, yeah. Why how, why have we not been doing that actually? Just slice runs and then they there you go. Well, that's if you want PB. You don't. I don't even. Oh no! I'm PB. just saying, like slice runs together and just make like new accounts and with like no oh. mics and all that stuff. So, so don't even play. So don't even play the game 50 times. Like just play it like five times and just keep slicing all that footage into different runs. <laughs> yeah. What if you enter like Teeth Pass as Digo and then on the next one you enter Teeth Pass? Uh, or no, sorry, not Teeth Pass. But you enter Volcano once you finish. All right, who's verifying these? <laughs> <laughs> who I was pretty fucking tired last night. I don't know. I forgot to. Oh, Slash forgot to submit his shit. He said. Depending on so who's I verifying, you could probably get away with it. Get get CFG in on it. Look, CFG would do anything to increase the active players, okay? Why? Because <laughs> that's the whole meme. How many people can we... How high can we get this game up? Iceberg isn't really confusing to me. Oh yeah, this makes sense. I have the shield! Why does the shield do nothing against the small? It's stupid! Have you ever shielded small? Hey, I- I- I-, I did my own tornado, yeah, I literally plant one after I got into a tornado, and then... I was like, hey, fuck you. Oh, are you serious? It went- wow. I wasn't behind enough. You're verifying it, Baku? Alright, Baku, when are you gonna ba become an authority? Baku's the monster racer mod now, nice. This game is... It's not as fun when you're not getting earned. Oh yeah, for sure. Definitely. It, it, it helped mine so much that I was just getting earned back to back. Or at least it felt back to back. That's why I'm shocked cheat percent hasn't taken off more. This cheat percent is literally just bigger and the whole time. Yeah, no enemies, no other items, no negative power-ups, just boost and fast character. Yeah. That almost sounds a little boring. Yeah, that sounds very boring. But it's why I haven't played it really. I felt it like. Yeah. It's I, I taking out everything it... that we're complaining about. Eh. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I think the one thing that makes it boring is that there's no opponents, you know, or anything. It's literally just driving around the track to boring music. <laughs> Excuse you, this soundtrack. Do you know the soundtrack won a PlayStation Greatest Hits medal? What the fuck it did? <laughs> <laughs> I just got spoke twice! It's so good they reused it for Teeth Pass Reverse.
can't believe I got smoked twice in that tunnel. What a joke. Alright, I just completed Iceberg. Nice. Welcome to the six minute track. Chief passes hell. Okay, there are like 12 like races left. Yeah, I feel like there's like 12 races left because you gotta do all these tracks and then you gotta do them in reverse. Yep. It's almost as bad as Mickey Raceway, where if you want to 100% the game, you had to do the tracks on easy, normal, expert, and professional. Mickey Raceway? Holy shit. I'm sorry, Mickey Speedway USA on the N64. I'm not sure about the GBC one, um, but I know my Is brother that loves that as, game. That's Crazy Frog Racer. Yeah, it's as good as Crazy Frog Racer on the PSP. I refuse to believe that exists, but the fact that you said PSP makes me think it might. It does exist. Alright, are you- I'm ready for the JK. I'm ready it's for like, the JK. It's like right now. <laughs> <laughs> it's never gonna come, Kami, I'm sorry. Uh... Tell that to somebody with too? erectile dysfunction, I don't wanna hear that. <laughs> Damn. The worst what? thing too is that it actually plays pretty good at Quanda Waffle. <laughs> so are we- when we're done with this, when everybody like, you know... The when the game but the meta becomes so stale because everybody perfect like you go frame counter wave dash spingle spongle when di <laughs> yeah like d are we moving to crazy frog probably not I I am not a fan of the game itself I think it's a funny meme but he the says gameplay is playing like, monster but, racer. dude the gameplay of crazy frog is so boring it's monster racer but no boost no nothing it's just crazy frog like on his little fucking hovercraft while he's like slapping his ass or some shit is it just uh, diddy uh, kong racing it, but with yeah, more diddy, frogs diddy and kong ass slapping wasn't fro yeah probably <laughs> it was like no drifting no boost nothing the fucking frog it's not that crazy I got three small urns, and like, there's like a slight, like, smile on my face. I know a little joy. Uh, this game brings brings people joy and pain at the same time. That's why we love it so much. When the, when the RNG smiles on you, it feels so good. How do I turn around, by the way? You don't. You don't, you gotta turn. Your you gotta turn, your character, there's no reverse, oh, technically. No. I thought that was a specific, like, turn around button. Nope. 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 I feel like this game would have one for no fucking re reason. It doesn't need one, it's perfect as it is. <laughs> I feel like you do need some, but only when you get stuck in the walls. Yeah, you do get- yeah, you kinda do get fucked on the walls, yeah. <laughs> Every once in a while- my favorite thing is when you get in a tornado, and like, it's so close to a wall, it- when it pops you out of the tornado, you're facing the wrong direction. Yeah, that's so dumb, like... What that's so fucked, that yeah. Your direction. I don't get it. It's so dumb, too, because when that happens, like, you lose, like, so much time doing the fucking half ass U-turn. I saw that happen to CFG, like, twice when we was racing it last night, and he was just, like, so done with it. I feel- I- I, I feel happy that I'm actually, like... Going through like some of these tunnels like smoothly. Yeah. This is an underrated gem. I might this add it to no. my top ten. I might add it to my top ten PlayStation uh, underrated gems collection. What, what are the what are the other games on there? Oh, you know the standard Bubsy 3D. Um, you know, um, Tombi. Tombi's a good underrated game. Um, but that game's actually good. I would disagree. I, 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 <laughs> I, I... It is good, that's why it's on my underrated gems list, Bandy. See, Bubsy 3D, no, wait, wait, like, next it's just Bubsy so bad. Bubsy 3D and Monster Racer. It's the perfect example of, here's not how, here's how to not do a 3D game. Exactly, look, every bad game has redeeming qualities. Do you know how many college students probably learned from that game? I mean, not every bad game has its redeeming qualities, because there can be some very, um... There can be some very, uh, games that should probably not exist games. Not in the sense of necessarily quality, but content within the game. Name one. I would not like to, because I would name some fucked up games. 
Hence why I say not in the con and not in the quality of like the gameplay or the game itself, but the content. But they're still like technically games. I mean, visual novels can be on that list, but I don't personally know fucked up visual novels. Oh, just ask me. I know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, school days. There you go. There's one. Oh uh, no, I know uh, one worse. Way worse. What is school days? Worse. And I don't want to know. A school days is just bad. Oh. School days is yeah. It's just it's just bad. Oh, is it, it like fucked up bad or like bad like? No, it's just bad. Yeah. Okay. Bad. Well, a little bit fucked up, but well, like, a little fucked up. The, I, I mean, you can't have a game called like, school fucked up days. Part of the internet, it's very tame. Yeah. Okay, cause like the, if it's problematic, fucked up. No, thank you. It sounds bad when you say it's school days. Like that just you just know that ain't gonna be good. It's something. It's something bad. No, yeah, the there are some. The problematic. There's some extremely fucking problematic uh tabletop rpg games that real well one's not really problematic it's just like weird and fucked up and stupidly horny and then the other one's like really like problematic as fuck but it, it interests like me that you're bringing them up and not naming them uh okay so one is called fatal it's fantasy something like it's it's a weird sexual thing um the other one, was, and this is how like, you oh, know it, it's gonna be a fucked up time, is called Racial Holy War, and I'm only interested in it because <laughs> of the extreme, like, the thought process behind some of the decisions in the game. Because, yeah, it's a complete, like, racist piece of shit, but even looking at the mechanics of the game, they're just so, like, dumb. Like, Hispanics, I'm not gonna refer to them as the, um the slur that they're referred to in game um they have an ability the, the, okay so they're considered they're called quote unquote and again this is not I'm me in the shield fuck you cunt the game refers oh to them as like lazy vermin but their game mechanic is that they can move first because they cross the border so much so like how can you be so fucking dumb that you call people this and then give them the mechanic that's not lazy. How can you, like, say, oh, Asians watch, you know, fake kung fu movies, and because of that, they gain better combat prowess? Like, how stupid, like, just some of the design choices from the gameplay element is just so baffling to me that it in interests me because I can dissect it. And it's, it, it, I don't know, it just lets me get into the mind of people that I absolutely fucking hate because I don't like racist people. Right, but you gotta think about the uh, the target audience. Who well, yeah, no, most definitely. For? It feels like I can understand people that I wouldn't otherwise understand because there's some people that, like, are fucked up in races but can actually change and learn because, like, my dad had... I'll, some racist tendencies and then I'm like dad you know like people that are of Islamic faith aren't all like suicide bombers and if you really want to go into like terrorism look at what the US is doing and like explaining stuff like that and then my dad learns but then there's some people that no matter what they're just gonna go through hoops to believe the stupid fucked up shit that they fucked up uh, they, they believe, but I kind of want to understand them so that I can better reach out to other people and, like, stray them away from that. God damn it. I am not going to PD. I got three big runs in a row, so my luck is out. Like, for the rest of this run, it's gone. I'm it's gonna... just gone? Yeah. But yeah, no, my Botanic Garden 2 reverse was so good last time that I knew this was going to be bad to run against. And it was! It was so bad, in fact, that I think I'm like neutral. Oh, what? What? <laughs> I was even Going back to the points made a little bit, uh, like a minute ago. Uh, I'm also quite interested in knowing, like, how, uh, how the minds of the people who subscribe to these ideas work. Uh, and I've always, like, well, first you start out with, like, oh, these guys are idiots. Who, who, why would you want to believe this? And then you oh. start to understand, like, okay, why are they, why are they like this? And I think, the way that it was explained to me, only like recently, kind of encapsulates it very nicely. Why I I want to like understand these people. It's everyone is kind of intelligent in their own way. Everything in their heads and everyone's minds 
even if you have these stupid opinions, it makes sense. It's just a gap in knowledge. It's just something that they don't know, where they can't connect the, the dots properly, because they're connecting the dots a different way than, than we do. Like, we think uh, we should be sympathetic towards people, but these guys these guys don't have this this point to, to connect to. I think... So, like, uh, there's a when you bring up intelligence, I think it's very easy to look at somebody that's racist and just be like, oh, they're dumb and they're stupid. And I'm like, that's very dangerous to think because people will be like, oh, well, like, you know, they're all, like, redneck hillbillies. The whole redneck thing is a, is a problem in and of itself because, like, redneck stem, stem from people that would wear uh, red handkerchiefs as union workers um, and the union workers that literally died for our worker rights that we have today but like people are like oh they're inbred idiot hillbillies hillbillies from this area and it's like no like look at the january 6th insurrection in america there was doctors and lawyers and teachers there was a lot of people that have you know college degrees that are like are like doing that they, they, there's people within well, the system yeah, that doesn't make yeah. them intelligent like no, you can them, get no, a them, degree without being an intelligent head, it makes sense to them it makes sense and we got to understand why where is this okay this point? in their head how does it make sense that they're going to storm the capital and not receive any consequences for it let me well, because let me been convinced of it and why have they been convinced of it let me let me go, go back the to the intelligence perfect. part because it's not I don't think just because you went to college and you got a degree makes you intelligence. I think you can be a dumbass with a degree. I think that's very possible. Yeah, yeah. But people have to realize that there's people within like these positions or educated positions that believe these things. Like there's doctors that believe that black people feel pain differently and because of them feeling pain differently they don't treat you know problems of their back uh, their black patients you know as seriously or as appropriately as they should you know so like it's not necessarily like oh just because they went to college they're like smart if they're racist and are in if they're like a racist and a lawyer what can what think about the damage that can do to society Think about it, like, on a systemic level, too. Yeah, oh. I think you can be intelligent one way and be a dumbass in a different way. Where, yeah, you can get, like, a college degree or whatever and get a PhD. Uh, but that means, like, fuck all if if you've been convinced of some other way that is not as uh, thought through and not as correct as, uh, as your PhD would be. And even then, there's you also, mean? like... You know, knowledge that is just incorrect, but was per per uh, perpetuated by like different systems. Because like it was in like people, for example, like again, you can go back to the whole like people view doctors viewing like black people as having you know different reactions and levels of pain and yada yada. But there could be stuff like oh, here's all these like accredited doctors making fun of the guy that says hey maybe we should wash our hands before we like work on patients and that person was ridiculed their entire life they were driven to suicide but that of what they did like it's everybody knows wash your fucking well almost everybody knows wash your fucking hands if you're gonna you know do shit like surgery or handle food or anything like that like sanitation is extremely important and all these you know, people in positions of power were just mocking it and taking it not seriously. My chat is like going off, and I should probably like read it, but also Monster Racer. Monster Racer. Imagine having deep, intelligent conversations while playing Monster Racer. <laughs> I think that makes you unqualified for any. <laughs> <laughs> like uh, with how po uh, with how poorly I'm playing, you could just label me a dumbass. Uh, eh, I mean, I think we're all dumbasses at the end of the day. Yeah, and that's okay. There's nothing wrong with being dumb yeah. as long as you're not you be like harming yourself to an extent and not harming others. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. I'd argue that being dumb inherently is harmful but not unless you say something that equates to your dumbassery i think you gotta like if you're into 
uh, you gotta be careful with what you do with yourself and your body when you're dumb. But, like, as long as what you're doing is happy, and again, I think you, I think people are allowed to participate in sadism to an extent, as long as they're not, like, fucking mutilating their arm, like, cutting, chopping off their dicks and shit. Um... Well, sadism but, isn't stupidity. I'm saying stupidity is inherently harmful. I guess. I don't... Mm, yeah, probably. I don't think there's any way, like, somebody can... I think people could argue against that, but I don't think I am in the position to argue against that. Um, you have to think about that. I don't want to know anybody how anyone's mind work. I can't even understand my own mind. Um, how to storm the cons... Capital consequences free. Take down the government, or be really white, cause as like <laughs> legit, the people that got in trouble like first at the Capitol were all like the minorities that were storming the Capitol. Like they got hit hard first, and then other people started getting hard hit. That's really just like, mmm. That's a bro moment right there. Um, I want to think Trump made the insurrection accidentally. No, he did not. No. That was definitely purposefully, and Trump is not going to face any consequences. And then he had to, like, go on stage and be like, uh, don't worry, go home. You're in the right, but stop. Flash has typed something in my chat. Said, Does it uh, shut the fuck up? Is harmful. <laughs> Is it shut the fuck up, says, Kami Gino? I saw I made 15 deep points last night. Monster Racer just prompts this kind of shit. Yeah, no, Monster Racer prompts this shit for some reason. It's the philosophy game. It's the philosophy- oh <laughs> my god. Plato <laughs> sitting down, <laughs> pondering humanity. Be like, man. This game is deep. Psycholog uh, psychologists hate this game. <laughs> Find out why. <laughs> Sigmund Freud is in the background of someone playing this game, watching. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sigmund Freud like is in the background, not watching. He's doing fucking coke. He is just <laughs> doing coke. That man loves cocaine. Uh, the guy was a quack, but it did, in a roundabout way, help things. <laughs> Like, a lot of his yeah. theories are wrong, but they're still used today, and, like, I don't... The, 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 hmm. Is the psychoanalysis the only thing that's still used? No, there's... Uh, most of what he is, um, he has, pro he has proposed is and used like, in some, say, trick. shape or form. Yeah. One way, shape or form. And it's so, like, why and how? You know? Well, I mean, he had some ideas that had a little bit of bearing, so, like, we just kind of developed them. Well, but yeah. there are obviously some other things that he ha said that were, like, complete whack job bullshit. Hey, did you know cocaine is, like, the best to do it all the time and you'll be immortal? I'm sold. Like the Chinese emperor who said that you should get mercury, like, in, in Halo or whatever. What? Hmm. And he fucking died <laughs> because he fucking just full of mercury. It reminded me of this one. Um, there was this one Greek person. He was like a political figure. Um, who was afraid of being poisoned, so he drank a little poison each and every day, so that he'd build an immunity to it. And then he got captured. And then when he tried to kill himself, he had poison on him. So he drank the poison, but it didn't work because he built it up an immunity. I didn't even know it was possible to build an immunity to poison like that, but then Depending on the poison, but don't try it, and like, you'd have to do it in- There's that a fucking- so unfortunate. There's a- Corn face guy with a Zoro mask and a top hat? What? There's a scarecrow in this game? That's oh, Hitchcock? You talk- Oh, Hitchcock, yeah, no, Hitchcock is the- The guy oh. with the motor on his back. I don't know, I just see like the- Title. Is he on it's, a stick, basically? I don't know, I just see his, like, face. Oh, you just see his face, I don't know. Yeah, this is 54 minutes in. I want out. BB, gonna add a drop of cyanide to every meal. <laughs> Slash says. 
Yeah. Look, Slash, yeah. if you keep adding cyanide, who knows? You know. might you, you might build up tolerance to it. There was a guy that was suicidal, so he like proposed and he was a scientist and he was like, you know what? I'll take the cyanide and tell you how it tastes and feels. And then like just seeing his notes are just like man fucking Christ. Let's see, um, this topic's far too serious. Nah, I saw a post that said if this shot is so important that it's free, then why then chemotherapy and insulin aren't? I'm like, they should be. Yeah. Um, not you, you. Let's go Norway, <laughs> where it's free. Are you in Norway? Wow. Yeah. Damn. Have you tried you cocaine every day? Monster you Racer? <laughs> no, I did not. I found it through a cult classic. Mm -hmm. It's probably cheaper to fly here. And get chemotherapy and then fly back to the US. Yes, that is Probably. more. Um, in, um, in Utah, there's a very. Uh, there's a very popular program supported by Republicans and Democrats alike, wherein uh, they will fly you first class to Mexico, give you a first, uh, first class hotel room, uh, give you rides to and from where you need to go so that you can go to a place, uh, buy the medicine, and then come back. And it's cheaper than getting it in Utah. What medicine? Like, zoned up? Just any medicine. If, if, if the medicine is not cheaper to get here, but that's a lot of medicines. So, like, you're literally paying people to go to Mexico to get medicine because medicine is too expensive in tastes your own like, state. Tastes like cyan? The color? Are you telling me cyanide tastes like cyan slash just because it has cyan in its name? I think wow. the guy was like, man. I'm sure that those names have, like, same root. Wow, Slash. <laughs> I think the guy was all like, oh man, this tastes like burning and, like, acid and stuff like that. Because, hey, guess what? That's pretty funny, Slash. I'm not gonna lie. I like the pun. <laughs> well, not pun, but I like the... I like the word use. There's allegedly a condition where you can... You can, like... You see words, and then you can associate a color to them. Oh right? yeah, um, you can used to know that. that. Like, if you have that, you can probably make that pun quite like neatly. There used to be there's there was this there's a few people that like can taste colors like they see it and then they get a taste in their mouth. It's probably all bullshit. No, I feel like it was pretty based inside because I know it's like a condition and it's real. I just don't remember what exactly it's called because it's very like possible. Like a lot of people don't know this, but um, if your sense of smell is gone, you're fucked when it comes to eating. Yes, your body will just reject. Shit. Like that's a huge issue with uh post COVID. If like. You're, if things get detached and you can't taste anything, and then they grow, they reattach themselves, like nerve and I, I, I'm not using like the proper terminology and all that stuff, but imagine like, uh, you got a cable box and there's four cables, um, and they go in straight lines, and then that's how like your taste and your nose and all that stuff works. Um, during COVID, those get severed off, and if they don't regrow back correctly, if it's like red to blue blue to yellow and all that stuff, then you're probably going to die because you can't eat food without, like, throwing it up or vomiting it. That was that's so true, scary. that sounds pretty scary. Yeah, a lot, uh, there's a few people that, um, are suffering that post-COVID. And you can oh, get better um, through a lot of intensive therapy, but for some people, it's just not working, and it's really fucked up. Because like they they have these therapies for that specific reason. It's not necessarily just tied to COVID. Where did this information come from? Because I haven't heard it before. Um, let me. I'm playing Monster Racer. I the issue with playing Monster Racer and talking about this stuff is that I can't take my hands off the controller and start looking shit up. Um, I'll have to remember, hey, color tasting and COVID, um, 
COVID, loss of scent, uh, loss of smelling, taste. You not like have a an Alexa or like a Siri that you can talk to? Me? No, I'm. I don't like that. I don't feel comfortable with that stuff because it's, I feel like it's an invasion of privacy. But I use Google services, therefore I am the product of Google, and they have all my information. Yeah. Where are you? I got a big run and I got smelled on the final lap. Good joke. At least when you're just using Google services, you choose when to give them information. Probably no, you do not. <laughs> the thing is just listening at all times. What happened to my chat? I mean, no, you literally they do. Actually they actually do listen to the chat on OBS enter it into their because thing. it's not LSD. Hey, they... Slash says you might be thinking of Keen Cynthia, where you can see around. Oh, uh, Cynthia, whatever. I can't describe it. Slash thinks he might know the editor. Synesthesia. Yeah. Yes. The, uh... Anesthesia, um, neurological, oh, in which, uh, information to, okay, synesthesia is what it looks like for the, uh, thingy, COVID, loss of taste, um, per minute, alright, I think I'm in the last race, no, maybe, no, not in no, those. okay, I looked down at the timer and I was hoping to see 130. <laughs> but like your keystrokes and all that shit, like they pick that shit up. Like, there's a lot of information they have on you that people don't know or realize. Almost like a lot of people don't realize that if people are sorting through your garbage, they can tell you exactly who you are as a person. Generally yeah. speaking. That sounds about right. I don't know if my brother is angry yelling or yelling because he's like happy or just having a conversation. He yells a lot. Why is Egypt just the mines but shitty? You mean Egypt Day? You mean Egypt Day? Yeah. I don't know. I think I'm learning how to um, pace my need for turning with like like mashing through the acceleration button to turn like good. Yeah. I'm learning tech and I don't like it. To do good turns. Who cares about good turns when I could just rely on earns? Ooh, that kind of rhymes. You hear that? I know, I got bars for days. Call me Billy Mays. <laughs> I was gonna make a joke about Frito sure. Lays. <laughs> I don't know, I can't really rhyme. I'm sort of in a daze. Ooh, okay, okay. Fuck, this. Race is nothing but a maze. I'm not even trying to do this on purpose, by the way. Fuck. Oh, that's so worth it, though. What are y'all? Oh my gosh. I just go to Museum 247. I had three big urns. Holy fuck. Here's my view on the information being known. As someone who actually has malice intents and wants something, they'll find a way. I would throw in the fire line, but you know, chat the ways. Yeah. I don't know. A lot of information people you can, like, people can get, not heard. I mean, I mean, Jesus Christ. I remember when Facebook first came out, it really bothered me how everyone was like, Oh, you know, tell tell Facebook who your family is. You know, tell them your first and last name. Tell them where you was born and when. It's like, Jesus. That whole like, thing like, was like, meant to be, like, to harvest, like, Mark Zuckerberg wanted to, like, hook up with college girls. College kids, yeah. 
little did he know how fucking big it'd be it'd get and how fucking many Facebook moms would come out of it. And the fact oh, old factory dysfunction, I think it's called. Uh and man, the fact that like he went to court from that and then basically everybody in the court was just like, What is the internet? And it's like, cool, this dude's just not gonna face any actual punishment for the the fucked up shit he did. My favorite is, thing is is, is, is how yeah, my favorite thing was I saw some of that. Like, my favorite questions were just, you could tell the people who knew what they were talking about and the ones who read an Oracle too, because, like, some people were up there like, now, um, we've read articles that Facebook, um, they, they steal people's data, and, um, with that data, um, they, they keep it in a storage bin, and they can access that, like, several years, like, in the future. And Moke is just sitting there like, what? Like a storage bin? Could you clarify? And they're like, you know, like 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 a storage bin, like 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 storage. And everyone's just like, oh. Was this I mean, the they technically have case? the right concept, they and right I feel concept, like but, but they Mark don't know. was also trying to play dumb too, because there's a lot of times people play dumb in court. Like, there's judges that will pretend how to not know what technology, like how technology works. Like in the Kyle Rittenhouse case, the judge refused to let people um, pinch and zoom because the defense claimed it adds pixels when that's completely false they put they said the defense has to prove that it by pinching and zooming it doesn't add anything but in a further sense of irony they played it on a 4k tv some of the footage on a 4k tv where it got upscaled so pixels were added so huh. like the whole thing is like oh i don't know this technology i'm old and it's like you probably actually do but you're using your age and pretending to like not know so that you well, can influence they, to play devil's advocate they literally could not know that a 4k tv is going to upscale the image anyway oh no yeah i can get understand that they don't know that but like i i feel like they're like oh i don't know nothing like you can pinch and zoom on this to do that i feel like the depending on your age you have to be extremely old like in your 70s, 80s, to not really even know about technology in this way, and the fact that you made it so that the defense, the, or sorry, the def the um, defense of Colin Rittenhouse made a claim, and it was an outrageous claim, and then you demanded that the per uh, the prosecutors prove that that claim wasn't false is complete. Just it, it, I, I think the intent was just. Hey, yeah, this is here's how we're not gonna, you know, have more evidence against uh, Rittenhouse since a lot of the proceedings of that court was just like this is just really stacked and this judge is cartoonishly corrupt. Oh, I blew up from too much speed. Oh yeah, that can happen. Eat. If you're close to the final lap, I found out it's actually worth it. Oh yeah, I did. There's a Gustavo, there's like a lot of misinformation on both sides, but generally if we view it from the leftist standpoint, then we get like the closest to reality there is and that boy shouldn't have been there, especially with his desire to want to kill people. <laughs> did he? I, I didn't keep up with the trial. Did he express a desire to want to kill people? Um, he expressed that there was a video that was denied from court evidence in which he expressed he the desire to want to shoot um, a perceived shoplifter. I know very little about this case, but wasn't it the case that he went out of his way to to do this stuff? It's yes. Not like it was so out in his property. there was many. There were a few people that went out of the way to go to the protest. What happened is that this dude saw this shit going on. He basically like he just found an opportunity to do to be a like vigilante hero or whatever. Um, so he went across state lines, um, which was breaking a couple laws. Um, he got a gun that he shouldn't have had. Um, 
And then, at first, I can understand the claims of self-defense, but later on, it clearly wasn't self-defense, and like just they just, just, they just ended up murdering a bunch of people. Well, not a bunch of people. They he ended up murdering um, three people, or injuring one and killing two people. He, I I have to recheck that. But isn't that by itself enough evidence to suggest that there was intent? Because he moved over a different state. The whole thing was like, oh, this is just some 17-year-old boy, and they constantly refer to him like as a boy to like make him seem innocent. Like, was, why, uh, why did he go to that state? Uh, he went to Wisconsin just because he saw all that shit like, going on, and he wanted to have some fucking action. Yeah, but what shit, what shit was going on? Uh, there was a protest in which... um. An officer in Kenosha uh, shot a black man like 18 times. Oh. Unless I'm mis mixing information because, like, I'm trying to remember everything, like, accurately, but I'm also. Like, I have ADHD brain on top of just poor memory. Um, I don't think it was. I think I'm mixing cases because there was another case where a black man got, like, shot. 18 times. Um, there's a lot of black people being shot by police. So. <laughs> um. Plus, there's. I'm, I'm, pro I'm still kind of processing the information of what happened in, uh, Waukesha on Sunday where a guy took his SUV. Um, it was an early Christmas parade and just, like, ran people over. And like killed people, and injured a shit ton of people. But why? What the fuck is the point? I think they were running from police. They were on bail for some. They bring. They like to bring up that people are on bail to like vilify them even more. Cause there's a lot of little things that media does to vilify people. But um, it was some dude on bail, and I think they were running for the police for some reason, and they ended up getting hitting people, um, while escaping. Are trying to escape the police. But, like, I don't know. The whole Rittenhouse thing is, like, kind of. left and shit, and it just shows hey, this is kind of our justice system in America. Like, is today a holiday, or is somebody messaging me prematurely saying happy holidays? Uh, uh prematurely, but I mean, I guess it. Oh no, I had class today, so I guess technically it's not a federal holiday if you want to go off that. But like most people think Thanksgiving's like a week, so hmm. it's a holiday and I'm pretty sure it's not actually federally recognized, but um yeah, there's I had, I had class. And then there's Black Friday, which if you're ready to see a bunch of people get trampled. I'm not, because most people only shop online nowadays. Yeah, I, I just feel like realized I see, that. I feel, I feel like the magic of... Well, I shouldn't say magic, fuck. The, the death counters no longer go as high. Because <laughs> yeah. there used to be death counters for this. Yeah. Thank goodness for the internet. Thank god that's not really a thing over here. Black Friday? You guys don't do Black Friday? Or really in people the with the way. common decency well, to do. not it's fucking okay. trample people. Week. So instead of being on Friday, it's an entire week, so very big yeah. brain so instead of all of it all of the things happening on one day it's across seven days instead that would actually help quite a bit if we did that to be honest yeah yeah but of course companies don't want to give low prices for an entire week a lot but of the, the times they're like, not even giving low prices. What they do is that they mark up their prices and then put them on sale, so that you're either paying the same price or less. It's kind of like what JC Penny did. The US? Yes, you can do that. Yeah. What? That's that's like mega illegal over here. Yeah, oh, and yeah? it should be. be. What happened with JC Penny is that like JC Penny was a uh, struggling company, so this one guy like came in and was like, "Why don't we just give the lowest deals possible, like the lowest prices possible?" you know, uh, like, where we can, and they did that, and, like, stuff was actually kind of pretty affordable, uh, relatively speaking, and then JCPenney was still struggling, so they fired that person, and what that per uh, what the person after him did, he, uh, was like, alright, what we're gonna do is we're gonna raise the price on all this stuff, but then we're going to mark things down on sale, so if something was, like, $15, then what you would do is you make it 
thirty dollars and then fifty percent off deal not too long after or a forty percent off deal so that you make more than that uh fifteen dollars that you're originally going to make that's why nowadays most people at least that i know like will like use a price checker to see like hey like what's the price like you know average so like it for me it shows a graph so if i see the graph spike and then drop down i'm like oh it got moped up never mind yeah that's that's what the companies do that like a, a lot of there's a lot of shitty and shady business practices in america and it's like they're rewarded for it so why wouldn't they there's nothing against it the companies are God, fucking i hate america and how we treat businesses i don't like the fact that poor people end up subsidizing some of the largest businesses in america and then those largest businesses can file bankruptcy just because they don't want to pay um people for giving them cancer looking at you johnson and johnson hey i'm on iceberg reverse nice you're, you're, you're getting close. Uh, uh, Fuck me, this is unbelievable. What's going on? Bad run. Oh my gosh, the worst teeth pass imaginable. Oh shit. What no. are you gonna PB? I, I don't know actually, I'm nervous. I thought PB was guaranteed, but now it's not looking like it. Some uh, after I just said 113, so world record is over for me, so I can't get world record because I still have another lap to do. Oh god! Ooh, fucking go! The RNG in this game is. Mm. Yeah. So, are the items weighted? Because, like, if they are, then you could possibly yeah, just... Like, are they weighted so that, like, if you're in last place, you're more likely to get, like, the speed boost? I think so. Then... The only example I, I know for certain is that in first place, you can't get the small power-up, as in you make everyone small. That's the only thing I know, really. Depending on the numbers, it might be best to just play on hard... Even though, despite all the bullshit, depending on how many earns you get, if you hang you back just a little. Yeah, but then what if you get like second, and then you get second again, and then you get second again? Oh my gosh, I saved you don't get enough points to win. Pass like I was expecting. I wouldn't know if that's a problem because it looks like the the places trade enough to make it so that you know. One seventeen forty-two garbage run. On something for you to rip. You done? Yeah, I'm done. Okay, I'm on iceberg. <laughs> I'm on hook. Well, I have you a PC. I have a faster load. Oh. Wait, you're on what? EPXC, the oh. other PlayStation emulator. Yeah. I know that one is. I think I think like there's one version that's allowed for Speedrun.com, and then like. Everyone else is just like, no, because, like, it's too fast. On the board it says, anything anything that's newer than 2.0 is not allowed. And I'm running on 2.0. Ah, the latest yeah. one that is allowed. I mean, like, in general, because I think... Uh, some Okay, so, like, the speed... The emulator thingy that people suggest on speedrun.com is, like, super outdated. But they're like, yeah, you should not run past 1.8. And I know I don't know why, and I'm assuming it's because it loads I mean, the game faster. It doesn't matter because it's in-game time anyway. It's in-game no, time yeah, anyway. No, yeah, most definitely. Yeah, but for other games, it could make a difference. Yeah. Jesus. Like I want to know what exact I want to know people's reasonings for banning what you know. I don't know. I just follow the rules. <laughs> like I want to know why the rules are what the rules are. I don't care. <laughs> Which is why, like, stuff like... 
it inter- I think I'm going. No, I'm not going reverse. Like stuff like when a card or a move or a Pokemon or whatever is banned in a game, I want to know exactly like what's the thought process behind it. You know, like the Black Lotus or whatever. Is that that? <laughs> yeah, that was banned. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah Better or worse? Than like me. it's too OP or it's too rare or blah blah blah, something like that. I think it's... In the case of, like, Meta Knight at Super Smash Bros. Brawl, it was literally just that he was bugged to the point where he was objectively the best character. To yeah, the but the ban... Tournament would literally just be Meta Knight versus Meta Knight, which no one wanted to watch. Okay, so and there's so a lot of misperceptions and misconceptions with that, because people still, like, the Brawl community were totally fine with Meta versus Meta. It was towards the end of the game's life, where Meta Knight got banned, mm-hmm. and that was only at like two or three tournaments, and a lot of the people were just not really happy with that. They were just like, well, like, it's the game has been established this long, and yada yada yada, and like, it's just these tournaments, so they're just like, why the fuck do we. No, fuck you. GG. So GG. It, it's not as like. They're so broken, they were banned from tournaments, and a lot of tournaments they couldn't play it. For the overwhelming majority of the life of Brawl, Meta Knight was, like, playable. Woo! Holy shit, I beat CFG oh, and Thrasher. Yeah, I, 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 I just took back... I just took back third place, because by nice. going by endgame time and minusing that by 115, yeah, I take back third place. Nice! GG, I'm happy, I'm happy with taking back third place. I... I think Meta Knight deserved to be banned, just because... Oh, most definitely, but it came late. He, he was the only character who was so good as to be in his own fucking tier. Yeah, they, he definitely deserved it, but it was so late and it didn't actually affect anything like people thought it did. It was like a lot of, like, again, it was just like a very few tournaments and the people that actually gave a shit about Brawl were like, that's dumb and stupid. On a different note, I think I... I think I uh, got a com gold on mine, but it didn't record it. Yeah. Fuck me, I guess. <laughs> I have I, I got two com golds this race, and I. What do you? Well, yeah, what do you get? I got. Oh god, I, I I don't remember the times, but I know I com gold. Um, was it Mad Jungle? <gasps> it was Mad Jungle, uh, Ford, and the other one was Egypt. Sh- Push mark? Maybe. Fuck. Wait, let me look at my splits. My splits should like. Uh. No, museum two. Wait, was it museum? Two? Okay, so I don't. I don't think I golded iceberg. I think I golded um, a mad jungle for sure. Yeah, I, I definitely got the community going mad jungle yeah. and museum two. Yes, this is a uh, teeth pass. Hey, we finished with a PB. Let's go. What's the last place like time? Uh, last place IGT on... or RTA? Uh, I guess the IGT. 120. 120. Okay, so RTA is usually how much extra? For Duck Station, it's usually like almost 15 minutes extra. Ish. Alright. Ish. So you'd have to finish behind like an, like an hour 38 to be in true last place. So you should be good, to be honest. Let's see, the mod note for Slash's run says Duck Station, so yeah. You need yeah. a... Faster than 137. And what, what are you on right now, Teeth Pass? Yeah, I think I'd... Oh yeah, you, you'll get it. Six, Even with that six minute fucking track in Volcano 2, you'll get it unless something drastic happens. I don't know why, but that started making me think about like the Pokemon Stadium announcer. This music Wait, is off. Teeth Pass six minutes? Cause I just realized this is like yeah, I'm on geez. third lap. <laughs> yeah, it's it's a yeah, six it's minute wrong. track just about. Yeah, six how six minutes is actually good. It's usually a little over six actually. Yeah, the com yeah, gold is six. barely sub sub six? Yeah, sub six. Yeah. With I speed running, I hold myself to like certain standards of performance and it genuinely like gets to me when I don't meet those standards. 
and sometimes I have like a perfectionist attitude towards things. Hence why I don't speedrun because it would be very bad for my mental health. But I think like just casual speed racing would yeah, be you could fine. Casually, where you never submit anything. Yeah, like Crash too, because I'm like I'm gonna just play on Duck Station. They probably don't allow it. I don't give a shit. I just want to play with Derek and have fun. Yeah. Or just do what uh, Small Ant does when he plays a new game. Just start the timer, first time playing, just very casually. It doesn't mean anything. It's just a timer. Yeah. Small Ant sounds familiar. During one of my um, during my Panera Bread interview, um, essentially the the boss was a, I either millennial or like close enough to being a millennial and she like oh yeah i i'm familiar with twitch and all that stuff i think she said she watches small ant she watches like a bunch of this and this and that her boyfriend or husband i think boyfriend uh does it and all that stuff she kept saying stuff like vibes and like very youthful language and she was like yeah like i sat down with you for like two minutes and i can already tell i want you to be on cashiers I was like, oh, cool, thanks. I guess the plan now is what to do next, because I definitely don't have it in me to do another Monster Racer run. Goodness. That was a lot of fun, though. I appreciate you coming out, Co-Team Kid. It's it's oh, cool no to talk and meet with you since I talk so much shit about you. You talk sh shit about Cartoon Racer? And that not not as I don't know. It's funny because like from Cartoon her perspective, Racer. what is this slander? Wait, Cartoon Racer. Yeah, no. <laughs> it's funny because like like in every like PB I have, like there's a pro to me. Well, I'm like, oh, that was a good time, but Cartoon Racer is probably faster. That motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> so so like it's just become this thing where like Dinkleberg. Yeah, it's Dink. It's fucking Dinkleberg 2.0. The only person I've had a uh, like a grudge against here is Waffle because he said. Fuck you to be. Once he got like, I think it was Mad Jungle or something. He got a a world <laughs> record, I think. And I took it back the next day. That sounds like so awful. Yeah, I, yeah. That's so awful. Yeah. I, I, I can just imagine one being like, "Fuck you." <laughs> be like, "Oh yeah, that's awful." More like a "I love you, fuck you." <laughs> yeah. Goodness. I'm too good at Monster Racer. What can I say, guys? Uh, holy shit. I'm just happy to have third place back, dude. Do you know how fucking terrible it feels to get knocked down all the way to shitty ass, like, God, what is this, like, 12th? Oh, no, 5th. 5th. You were, you were 5th before doing the timer. Yeah, it's like, what the fuck, 5th? I mean, that's not too bad. Alright, I'm on Volcano. Let's go. I, it, was, it was almost 7 minutes on Teeth Pass. So I have about 10 in-game time before I just retire. Yeah. Oh, Volcano is against Master. I think that's Master. That's what he's called, but you never see him in the game other than this very moment. He might be in the manual, who knows. But he's not in the in the game otherwise. I wonder if they like look good in the like, manual versus like you know here. How long is Volcano? It doesn't seem very long. I think it's the second shortest track behind mine. Man, this place is fucking lit. I appreciate no one laughing at that, that joke. Good. Was I supposed to? I don't know. No, I appreciate no one I laughing at it. I, it. I said this I place it. is fucking lit, cause like you know. Yeah, fire yeah, yeah, but... yeah. Fuck. Master, more like sub optimal. Got him. Oh, got him. Right. Guys, I'm gonna head out. I'm getting a bit of a headache. Yeah, right, I think I'm ahead. That was. I think I'm ahead as well. I'm, I yeah, I'm no one's gonna like... stay for me to finish. <laughs> Now I'll stay for to finish, but after that I will uh, probably head out and maybe do like a Spyro 2, like 100%, just listen to music. I am falling <laughs> off every possible Later, fucking thing. Well, see ya, Bandy. Take care. Be safe. Still want to look up that Kenosha thing. 
or the the victim of the police for Kenosha. Or yeah, yeah Kenosha. Kenosha. I keep not trying to say Waukesha because the Waukesha thing. Wait, wait, Kenosha. How long has Composer been in here? Like a oh, long while. Like before oh, I Omi's got on, dead. before like. Naomi's just gone. I think it'd be neat to see more people play this game with a uh, input display on so you can see exactly what they do. Um, is there a thing where I need to pause it at? Uh, timing timing just stops as soon as you cross the finish line on Volcano 2, so yeah, timing is like okay. done. Yeah. Timing Give me is, like, a moment, done. 5 yeah. out of 5 on Volcano 2. GG, you're not Wait, last. did I skip what? over... did I skip over in game time? Or do I... Uh, it shows up at the end, no matter what. No, like at the, after these credits. No, uh, so it, that's manually done by the moderator, all of the individual tracks. And Why the, uh, would the you? The time flashes before before the you finish the race is actually flashes. Oh, I mean, I could do that for the moderator and screen cap it by like putting it in a video, pro uh, my video editor. Yo. And I kind of like because the split was late, and then like. I stopped it and then I started it again because I wasn't sure. The fact that it says game over is so like not encouraging. <laughs> yeah. All right. Um, uh, I'm gonna take a break. I'll probably just leave my stream open for like five minutes, and then I'm just gonna vibe and just sit back and relax and just listen to music and probably not talk much. So. Are you gonna do more speedrunning? Um. Yeah, I'm probably gonna do Spyro 2 100%, but like, I'm like new to that, so it's not even a speedrun, it's more oh, like a oh, casual play. Oh, what happened to Crash 2? Oh, fuck, actually, let's do Crash 2, I lied. I just have to get the- I'm gonna get the power ROM real quick. I mean, no, I'm not. I have a Whoa. PAL copy that I'm going Whoa. to put in my PAL PS2. Do not use the website that I linked because I told you to not use it and to not illegally download games off that. Oh, I wouldn't ever think of using that website. What are you talking Very about? Very real. Much legit. Oh, shit. Uh, right? Slash, did you see I, uh... I PB'd in Monster Racer? Part of oh, me yeah. wants to join that Spyro thing. Or, sorry, the Crash 2 thing. But part of me is like, my right eye is flickering and I'm very tired, so good night. If you sh yeah, you should head to bed <laughs> if you're that tired. You should, you should head off, get some sleep, have a good night. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, thanks for coming, everybody. Um, I have a end screen. Fuck, god damn it. Uh, there I have an end screen now. Um, yeah, I'm gonna see who I can. I only have two people, so it's not really worth reading. Though I do kind of want to see who's online, because I'm gonna pass out to whoever is online, I guess. Uh, GB's online, playing Ultimate. There's Derek. There's all these people. Yo! Yeah.